Hey guys, God doesn't want to use you. Got a minute? This is something else that we hear all the time, that God has planned for us to use us, and He wants to use us for this, and He wants to do this, and it's just not true. It is true that God wants to work with us, but to say that God wants to use us makes us seem like we're tools used one day and tossed, whenever reality is God wants so much more for us. He wants so much more with us. Jeremiah says, For I know the thoughts I think towards you, says the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you a future and a hope. God has such great purposes for us. He has such great plans for us, but it's not so that he can just use us like we use paper towels and throw them away. God wants to be a part of our life. He wants to co-labor with us for plans and purposes that are going to enlighten us. It's going to benefit us. They're for us to prosper. It's for us to move forward. So we as a church body really need to get away from saying that God wants to use people. It reminds me of an ex-girlfriend that I had, and we uh, picked out songs for each other, and the song that she had that reminded her of me was a song called Use Somebody. The song goes on to say that she could use somebody like me. Man, did I feel loved. There's probably a reason that I say ex-girlfriend, right? God doesn't want to use somebody or use us. He wants to be with us. Sin broke this gap in between us and God, and he wants to come back to the point where he can commune with us. He can, he can be with us. It's a relationship that he desires, which is so much bigger than using somebody. It's so much better, too. Thanks for taking a minute.